Hey guys, it's Friday, September 4th, 2015, and I'm Lady Liberty Stacker uh, coming back to you with a hopefully a relatively short video. I had a comment uh, from a reply to one of my comments on uh, Silver Sirens video on the Graded Libertad uh, Silver Five Coin set that was released and sold out by Modern Coin Mart yesterday. And uh, mention uh, was made of population reports as to um, how many were graded at a specific, um, you know, ounce, uh, half ounce, how many of them graded at a 69 or a 70 and so forth. And um, I told him I would uh, put up a video. Um, so without further ado, um, let's look at, since these coins in question were NGC uh, graded, um, I'm going to show you how I go about doing that. You go under ngccoin.com, very simple, and then here where it says uh, research, NGC research, you come down to census. On PCGS, that'll say population report, but here it says census. Then you go over to the drop down menu, and I try to, uh, I don't have a tripod today, here it works, so this is a little difficult. But um, I'll zoom in a little bit for you. You drop down to world coin status here. And you scroll down. And under the search by criteria. And I'm going to look for Mexico right now. Just because those are the coins that were being sold. You're going to look for Mexico. And here you're going to put in 1905 to date. You're going to put in the denomination. I'm going to look for one Anza. And you're going to look for all dates. You're going to go down to 2015 and click search. And here comes the report. And let's see, you have over here on the left, I'll kind of move, try to move my uh, camera a little bit. You have one ounce, you can see my cursor over here. Uh, you have a one ounce silver. Um, proof uncirculated here. And there's a total of 91 of them. And you move it all, all back out just a little bit. You go all the way over to the right. Oops, it's not going to let me do it. You have to be a member. But uh, you can go back and look again. And it, of course, you probably should sign up to be a member. But I'll do the same thing again. I'll put on Mexico. Uh, Got to find it here. 1905 to date. We want to put one Anza in there. And we want to put the 2015 year and uh, click search. And there it is again. And then it's this line here. It's got 91, the second one down. And on the right it says 69, grade 69, there's 21. And at 70, there's 70 of them. So that's how you find out a population report of a coin with um, NGC. With PGCS, PCGS, I can't say that right. <clears throat> I want to say it the other way. I think I'm dyslexic. But anyway, PCGS, you go to the main site. It's uh, PCGS.com. Go to the main page. Go all the way down to the bottom. And where it says under customer service here, you have cert verification. You have grading standards. And you have, you, know, you come over to resources, the third uh, column, and you click on population report. And here, you're going to go to World, and you're going to go to uh, Mexico. And I've not looked, looked these particular coins up, or uh, pieces up, rather, but uh, this would be probably silver. It's not bullion. Um, you got to pick the right one here. Um... We'll see what, for the heck of it, I'll put in silver bullion coinage and I'll see what I can come up with. I'll put on Anza here. And we'll come down. You scroll down on the right-hand side and you come down to the very bottom. And the last uh, thing they have in the population report is 2014. So they don't have, doesn't look like they have, they should have 2015 because we bought them. But they were NGC, so it doesn't look like PCGS has any graded ones here from this report. It might be in another location, but that's generally how you get there. Um, I'm going to go back and show you another. I'm going to pick um, Anza here, 
I'm going to go back. I want to show you. I, ha I bought a gold Libertad 1 ounce 2015. And it was PCGS. So I put gold bullion. That's what it was. It was an Anza. And you come all the way down. And the lowest it goes is 2012. But you get the general idea. I'm going to have to dig around a little bit more for it. But that's generally how you find out about the population. Um, I don't want this video to get too long, but um, you kind of play around on these websites. I may try to join one of these if it doesn't cost anything to have more access to the population report. At least you don't need it on PCGS, but you do need it. With um, You have to sign up to be a member. And I, I don't know if I think that costs money. I don't know. But you can click on um, back to the census report and put in your information again and look at it real quick, you know, with uh, the NGC site. So I hope this helps. Um, just kind of might help you um, learn more about coins before you buy. Uh, one other thing, when you look on NGC here, you can verify the certification. You click on this and you just put in the number to verify. And you do that, you know, on uh, maybe an eBay listing or something to verify the authenticity of the coin. And then here uh, with uh, PCGS, they also have it. And again, you go back to the main page. I'm trying to go back to the uh, home page here. And you come down to the customer service and you put cert verification. And there it is. You just type in the number and click verify. So... Hope this helps. Uh, video is getting kind of long. And uh, please uh, rate, comment, and subscribe if you haven't already. And guys, make it a great, safe holiday weekend. Take care until next time.